Hello friends. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and share this to my other pages and then we'll get started. Put it on our makeup. When you pop on, let me know where you're watching from. Say hello. And make sure that you click the share button in your bottom left hand corner. That always really, really, really helps. And then if you know anyone who is at home and who would enjoy a tutorial, go ahead and uh, tag them in the comments too. All right, so I'm gonna share this to my beauty page, which is called Beauty by Raya Hope. And then I'm gonna save or share this to my actual Facebook page, which is called Raya Coleman. So make sure you are following in all of those areas and then we'll get started. But this is gonna be a pretty fast, simple tutorial. I just needed to put some makeup on, so I figured I'd do it with you guys. Hi guys. If you guys have any, um, if uh, you guys have any makeup questions, holler them out in the comments during this live and I can kind of try to help you guys as much as possible verbally. Um, but like I always say, make sure that you send me a selfie facing a window if you guys need a color match or any recommendations. So this month, every month we have like a new deal. This month is really good because it is... Um, fully customizable and it's like products that everybody loves. So this month you can choose any foundation, any primer and in any facial brush. And I think that's for 73 or $78, which is a really, really good deal for all three things. Um, so if you've been wanting or thinking about trying the foundation, now's the time to do it because of the awesome sale that's going on. So again, that's going to be under kudos on my website and my website's right here, rayahopebeauty.com. Um, my website always is the same. Um, big alert flash red warning sign, not warning, but just alert sign. If you're spending $200 or more, message me before you do, and I can set you up a reward link. That way you earn rewards with your purchase. Um, it can't be used on past orders. It has to be on a current order, um, that hasn't been placed yet. So I need to set you up a reward link first. So if you have yet to set up a reward link with me, make sure you do so. They're good for 10 days. So, um, you start earning rewards at $200, um, or 200 points, but it equals $200. So uh, let me know before you guys do. Yes, you ordered the new primer. Oh, it's so good, you guys. I'm having like a hormonal breakout right there. So we're gonna do some really good coverage for that little bad boy. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. But um, I also wanted to go over, like you said, the primer. We just launched this guy. This is the Mattifying Face Primer. It is so incredibly good. Completely hides your pores, completely keeps your oil at bay. So if you have any oil, if you have any large pores, this guy is gonna be game changer for you. Um, so again, that is available for individual sale or in the kudos. Because like I said, you can choose any primer, any foundation, the kudos, including the BB Flawless, including the Liquid Touch, including the Press Powder, the Stick Foundation. So good. How uh, long enough I did not change the color of my hair at all. So surely it's gonna, it's supposed to take out the brassiness or the yellowness in your hair. Um, but if you saw no difference, then make sure that you leave it on a little bit longer. I usually leave mine on for like two to five minutes and make sure you really like massage it into your hair. Um, and that goes for everybody. If you guys have any hair questions um, or need any hair recommendations too, I like meant to tear that in half. That didn't help. Uh, message me and I can give you a recommendation for that as well. All right, so now we're gonna do our Liquid Touch Foundation. This is my favorite coverage just because it's matte. It looks incredible all day. It also helps to blur your pores. It has an ingredient in it that doesn't clog your pores. So if you have really sensitive skin or you're prone to breakouts, the Liquid Touch is gonna be incredible for you. It's so, so good. Um, if you need to be color matched for this, let me know. Um, just send me a picture facing a window. It does not need to be sunny outside. It could be raining, snowing, craziness. It does not matter. All I need is natural light. So face a window, stick your phone in front of your face, and take that picture. Um, be facing the window. That's the only important part. I know, right? It's getting so long. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy. I kind of want to grow it out to be like about this long and then kind of do the tapered, kind of like, um, like an angled and then super textured. So I can like curl it, but I can also look like this. Not like this, but like how my hairstyle is now. Um, so I have options. So that's what I'm going for. But you guys know me. I always cut my hair. I'm like always going back and forth. All right. So now I'm going to use probably like four-ish drops of the Liquid Touch Foundation. This is in the shade Lace. 
and we are just going to apply this using the powder concealer brush. So both the liquid and the BB Flawless, <laughs> BB Flawless, mm. both the liquid and the powder concealer brush are both on sale in the Kudos. So you can pick both of these in that little Kudos order. And then you get to choose any primer. So on my skin right now, I have on the um, setting spray, this guy. And I have on my mattifying face primer, which I showed you this guy. So I did my pre-makeup routine on my um, my uh, tutorial yesterday live. So if you want to see it live, you can. Um, or I recorded like every part of it. And I have that also up on this page, Ray at Hope. So um, if you want to see the pre-makeup routine, if you're not sure what that is, be sure to check that out. I also will have it uploaded to my IGTV on Instagram probably upload that today actually got my powder concealer brush yay it's so good took your recommendations and use eye primer on my eyelids and look snow naturally smooth I love it Lisa good job but yes the eye primer is really good if you have a lot of fine lines and wrinkles all right so that right there was again like four to five drops like four ish drops and you can see how incredible this coverage really is completely took away any redness completely muted my skin remember those really ugly blemishes right here poof gone and I see a hair out of the corner of my there you are I love that just a little bit of this foundation goes such a long way all right so now I'm gonna take just a little bit I'm just gonna squeeze it on my finger use a little bit more and then I'm gonna dot this around my skin and then I'm gonna go in with my blending bud and we're just going to start to apply this Bounce this off our skin. Now this is going to bump up the coverage a little bit. It's also going to make our makeup look super, super smooth because of the blending bud. So these are damp. I wring them underneath the water before I got on. Um, and then you squeeze them till no water falls from them. These are not part of the kudos, but I highly, 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 I couldn't recommend them enough to add them to your order because they seriously are the like key to making your makeup full coverage and super, super smooth. I'm telling you guys, these are... This is the answer to your prayers. <laughs> if you have a lot of fine lines, wrinkles, large pores, um, or if your just makeup isn't like setting right or sitting nicely, or you're just looking at your foundation you're like, this could look better. <laughs> the blending buds are what you're gonna want. So make sure you snag these. You get two when you buy them from my website. You get the large and the small. I'm new from Nevada, awesome, welcome. Thank you for being here. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with my Skin Perfecting Concealer in the shade Organza. And I'm gonna use a little bit more than I normally do because I'm gonna use it on my angry blemishes that I have there. So I'm gonna uh, tap this on my under eye. And then like I said, I'm gonna put this on those angry little guys down there. And now I'm gonna take my smaller blending bud and I'm gonna blend this in. So the concealer I use kind of as like my, my touch up stuff. So I do my foundation as my full coverage my coverage all over and then if I need a little bit extra help in certain areas that's when I'm going to go in with the concealer and this concealer is so incredible you guys it's so opaque meaning you can't see through it and I love that it's super full coverage and it doesn't feel full coverage on your skin now I do know that some people don't like the concealer because to each their own it's totally okay so what you could do instead is you could actually use the stick foundation in the shade scarlet for your concealer instead because it's a stick you'll just uh, draw it on and then blend it out just like we did with the blending bud because the stick foundation is also an option for the kudos so I would grab multiple if I were you I would grab one for your foundation one for your concealer or one for your pressed powder which is what we're about to use too so all of those are available in the kudos right here rayahopebeauty.com now I'm going to use my setting powder you don't necessarily have to use this step unless you have super oily skin or you find that your makeup is smudging or coming off on your shirt or your phone or whatever. This is going to create a kind of a buffer between your makeup and the rest of the world. <laughs> so it absorbs any of those natural oils that are pushing against your skin, making your makeup come off or make it look really dewy or oily or whatever so I'm gonna pop this on all over and like I said it's going to one it's gonna make everything a little bit fuller coverage and it's gonna help to minimize the appearance of pores but I love that it keeps everything in place despite being really oily so this is always a good step and you don't have to do it all over like I am you could do it wherever you're oily so say you're only oily on your forehead you could use that product just on your forehead thank you we are doing really well we are, the kids are playing in the driveway, playing soccer. 
Tucker is chasing Abel. <laughs> the stick is really good. Yeah, I'm putting makeup on for the first time in three weeks. Yay, Denise. Honestly, now is the perfect time to play around with makeup because no one's going to see you. <laughs> so try those new things. Try those new techniques. I actually, I'm going to be totally honest with you. I suck at putting on false eyelashes. I can put them on other people, no problem. Putting, putting them on myself is so difficult. I don't know why. It's like it senses the fear and they're like running for the hills. So for the last couple days, I've been trying to put on false eyelashes. I did it for the first time the other day and Ryan was like, whoa, look at your eyelashes. I'm like, I know, I'm just practicing. So now is the perfect time to do those little practice things, those different techniques or the things that you're too scared to do and you're like, oh, I don't want to look like a crazy person all day. Now is the time to try it. So if you want to try anything now's the time and unique has a love it guarantee a lot of places right now aren't um aren't honoring the return policy target for example i have some shorts that i want to return and i can't return them for like two weeks which i'm like i just want to get them out of my house at this point um unique's not doing that we are still honoring our full love it guarantee so if you don't love anything for any reason return it and get your money back no issue I need the spray that sets your makeup primer and those sponges. Kathy, this is the Touch Bold setting spray. So this is what you're going to want. And then the blending buds are what you're going to want. So you can find both of those on my website right here, rayahopebeauty.com. And then if you have any issue finding anything on the website, you can always just message me. What brush did you use to apply your foundation? I use the powder concealer brush. So I use the foundation side, put it all on, and then I'm going to use the concealer side to do my eyeshadow here in a second. Pressed powder velour is out. What color should I use? Um, What color do you use in the liquid? Velour and taffeta are super, super similar. Just taffeta is a teeny tiny bit darker. Um, so you can absolutely get away with switching and going up a shade to taffeta. Um, but if you're not comfortable with that, you can use the Unique brand, the Unique Touch one. Uh, it's the other type of pressed powder. And I would get the shade Camlet, which would be a little bit similar. Where's the yellow orange flat blending bud from? This one's from, it's by a company called Real Techniques. You can get them on Amazon. I like it because it's flat, so it fits really nicely on my under eye. Did I miss anyone else's comment? Just comment it again. All right, so now I'm gonna use my pressed powder in the shade Taffeta, and we're just going to pop this all over, and this is just gonna give us much fuller coverage. It's also going to make everything look very blended, very melted, very porcelain doll-ish. This is like my other hidden trick to getting that really flawless full coverage. So if you're having a difficult time achieving that, definitely make sure you grab the Mineral Touch Press Powder, which I said is on sale in the Kudos, and then make sure you grab the Blending Buds because those two things really, really matter. Like, look, you can't even tell that I have all those blemishes there. I love this coverage, you guys. It's so incredible, it's so good. And it's actually super healthy for your skin. I don't know if you guys have ever used like MAC products, but that is like studio makeup. It's really, really heavy. It clogs the pores and cause breakouts. But this is such light, incredible coverage. It's not going to clog your pores. It actually has ingredients in it that help slow the appearance of aging. <laughs> yes, please. Sold right there. Um, so it really is incredible makeup. How to keep my under eyes from creasing. It makes my under eyes look way more wrinkled when they are. Stacy, totally normal. Um, so I would make sure to up your skincare. That is really, really going to help. The Uplift Beauty Serum, I know it's currently out of stock, but that's an incredible product. The Brightening Face Max Mask is really good. But for a lot of creases or fine lines on your under eyes, you're going to want hydration and less product. So my like tricks for that would be your concealer, mixing it with your BB Flawless or your Liquid Touch and applying it together instead of layering. And then the blending buds are going to be like your saving grace for your under eyes. So you're going to really blend that out with your blending bud. Um, and then you're going to want to set it very lightly. So for you, what I would do is I would, instead of using the setting powder, which can be drying and heavy, you're going to want to use the Mineral Touch Press Powder because of how light it is, but it still is very setting. So you'll use that with, say, a dry beauty blender, and you're going to push that underneath to set it. So it's like less product. Um, can you use Surreal today on your eyes and cheeks? Ooh, that's a good idea. I'm going to use Sisterly today, though. Sorry. Do you have to join? No, absolutely. That's why I love our company. We are not a subscribe, like renewal, nothing. We have those options, but they're not 
pushed on you. If we honestly switch to that, I might not be down. <laughs> like, I am not a fan of like signing up for stuff and then forgetting about it and then getting charged and getting things shipped. I'm like, I'm not ready for this. Why is this here? We're not like that. We're exactly like shopping from Target or Macy's or whatever. You buy what you want, when you want, and it's all right here, rayahopebeauty.com. So uh, Janie, I hope I said your name right. You're gonna shop right here, rayahopebeauty.com. You can type it into your web browser or you can click on the link. So again, Raya, R-A-Y-A-H-O-P-E, rayahopebeauty.com, all one word. All right, so now for contour, I'm gonna use my beachfront bronzer in the shade Hermosa on my tapered blusher brush. You guys, I can't help but smile because I'm so stoked this brush is on sale in the Kudos too. So you get to choose any facial brush. It doesn't have to be a foundation brush. When I first heard about the Kudos, I was under the assumption that it was just uh, foundation brushes and I was like, oh, that's kind of cool, all right, whatever. When I found out it was any facial brush, the blusher brush, the tapered blusher brush, I was so excited. Because this brush, I swear, is the best brush in the history of blushes for contouring, you guys. It does all the work for you. It's so, so good. You can warm up your complexion with your, with your bronzer. You can sculpt your face with your bronzer. You can really take away if your foundation is looking really light or making you look washed out. It will take away all of that. It's so, so good. Now you don't have to go as bold as I'm going. You can go a little bit lighter if you're wanting. It's all personal preference and it's all within the pressure of your hand. Whatever you prefer or don't prefer. I know I don't really like auto ships either. But if you do like auto ships, we do have that option for the foundation and for the um, eye products. So you'll see it. It'll say like subscribe and save. It is a little amount of savings. Um, I think it's 15% savings if you do do the subscribe but you'll see it like you're not going to accidentally do it you can't accidentally do it you have to like very mindfully sign up for it i'm using the shade hermosa in the bronzer which is my favorite color now if you're learning to do your contour or you are not very used to doing it um this color may be a little bit darker for you so what you will want is the shade sunset in the beachfront bronzer will be perfect and then like i said Tapered blush your brush is the name of the game. It's so good. I will double chin, mostly genetic and moving. Any tricks on how to help? Oh, yes, Heather. I actually talked about this in my live yesterday because I'm a little bit heavier right now than I normally am. So I've been contouring a little bit further than I normally do. Usually I just stick to this little um, jawline right here. But if you do want to hide your triple double chin that we're all getting with this quarantine 15, <laughs> Just kind of go around just in this area contouring that it'll help to give the illusion that you have a shadow there which will make it look a lot more chiseled so that's a little trick but tapered blush or brush I'm telling you if you don't have this grab it today it is the biggest game changer thing ever all right so now for blush Hallelujah! I'm so excited the blush in the shade sisterly i can say is finally back in stock it's in stock run for your lives before it sells out again it keeps selling out it's the best blush color in the history of blushes so i'm going to use it on the blusher brush i always swirl on the cap smile and you're going to tap this on the reason that this is the bl the best blush in the history of blushes is because of how gorgeous this applies how soft it melts into the skin look at how pretty that is it just it gives you this gorgeous little sheen to your skin it makes you look dewy makes your skin look glowy it is so incredibly beautiful without looking too overdone as a blush you don't feel like oh gosh look at i just look like a clown now it's not that way at all it's so blendable it's very light so you can build it up if you want but you guys i'm telling you this is the best blush Ever. and it looks incredible on all skin tones if you're dark if you're light i don't care it looks incredible isn't that so pretty so dewy so glowy i'm not even gonna highlight today because that is good enough for me all right i'm gonna use my eyeliner in the shade perfect and i like to pop this on my water lines just to make my lashes look a little more bold and then we're gonna do our eyeshadow very quickly i'm gonna do a really simple eye look just kind of something in the crease basically um Super, super simple. Do they have samples? We do not have samples because we have a love it guarantee. So you can try the product for two weeks and return it for your money back. So because of how amazing our return policy is, we don't have a um, sample pack. 
Why does the Mineral Touch Press Powder make me look cakey? Should I just try the pressed powder? Uh, Mackenzie, I would do the Touch Mineral one, not the Unique one. There's Unique offers two types of pressed powders. One is called the Unique Press Powder, and then one is called the Touch Mineral Press Powder. So grab the Touch Mineral one, that's the one I swear by. Um, but message me, if you're having any issues with your makeup, shoot me a DM, shoot me a message here on Facebook, and I can help you figure out what is the issue or what needs to, like what routine you need to do. What was the old brush blush color kind of like sisterly? It was called the shade Serene. That one is no longer around. It was a limited edition color, but Sisterly is extremely close to that. They might as well be sisters. <laughs> Get it? Uh, 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 what kudos this month? Stacy? it's any foundation, any facial brush, and any primer of your choice. Such a good deal. Now, if you need to be color matched for the primer or for the foundation, or if you're not sure what primer to get, just message me a selfie facing a window today and I can give you a recommendation on what to grab. All right, so for my brows, I am just taking my brow pencil and I'm just following the natural shape and direction of my eyebrows. They're about to get so full in these next few weeks. <laughs> but this brow pencil honestly makes doing my eyebrows so incredibly fast and easy. Again, I say if you are new at doing your eyebrows or if you're new at makeup in general, the brow pencil is the perfect learning tool. It has a retractable tip so you never have to worry about sharpening it. It's uh, water resistant and it has the finest tip ever so you get perfect hair like strokes every time. So again, since we're all stuck at home, now is a perfect time to practice these tools that you think, oh, I can never do that. Contour brows, you got it right here, rayahopebeauty.com. And again, if you're like, this isn't for me, I don't like this product, it doesn't look good on me, totally fine. Try it, return it for your money back if you don't love it. Do you have a new primer? Yes. So this is the Mattifying Face Primer. This is what I've been using and I love it. It gives my face the most blurred, like, perfection underneath my makeup so my makeup looks even more full coverage and it helps to keep my makeup in place all day despite any oil. Got set up for delivery three months ago. So excited. Yay, I'm so excited for you, Candice. The best brow pencil ever. Amen to that. Looks like serene. That's true, Carol. What do you suggest for pore primer as far as skincare? To minimize the appearance of pores for skincare, I would recommend um, the brightening face mask helps to shrink your pores and also the rose water. So both of those are toners. Um, and then we have the Uology Night Cream, which you can put toners in for the boosters, such as Elasticity. Um, what are the other ones I have? I have Elasticity, I think it's Time Correcting, and Firming, I think are the boosters I have in mind, and it really does uh, tone your skin. Can one item for the Kudos order be returned? Does the whole thing need to be returned? That's a good question. I'm not entirely sure. But even if you do have to return the whole thing, you get a whole new product, so. Um, do you have big pores? I want to know the no primer helps. I don't have very large pores, um, but I can show you before and afters on my Instagram story today of people that I do know that have large pores that have been showing before and afters. Tell me my eyebrows wax. I know, right, Stacy? Shopping for makeup during quarantine is dangerous. Only third or three days. <laughs> I feel you, Heather. All right, so now for our eyes, we're gonna do just some simple colors. I'm going to use this color right here, which is the shade Impish, and I'm going to grab it on my powder concealer brush, which again is on sale in the Kudos, and I'm just going to use this all over. So this color is really peachy and very nude, um, so I'm just going to use that all over, kind of as just our base color. Now, using the other side of this brush is really, really nice for just throwing the colors on very, very quickly, very evenly, so if you are in a rush or if you're not like a huge eyeshadow person, this side is like perfect because it just throws it on there and it throws it on there very blended and very evenly. So that was Impish and now I'm gonna go in with this color. What color is that called? Hold on. Pause. Oh wait, that's Impish. Okay, so what color is this one? This color is Melodosis. I think I'm saying that right. So Melodosis is the one I just actually put all on, sorry. Now I'm gonna go in with Impish, which is a little bit darker, more of a peachy uh, bronze, and I'm gonna pop that just in the crease and outer corner. 
same thing on this side just like that just gonna give my eyes a little bit of a pop Okay, so now that we've done that, now I'm gonna take my finger and grab the shade Discreet and pop this on just the lid, just like this. And you guys, these palettes are completely customizable. You get to pick every color in them. You can even buy them individually if you already have a palette um, that you just wanna sub colors in. They're very affordable. You can actually buy them, buy them by themselves for I think 12 bucks or $14, I forget, with, the, uh, with their little case. And there we go. Our eyes are done. I am actually going to take my liner shader brush and I'm going to grab this color. I think it's the shade Witty. And I'm just going to line my under eye with this just to give the eye look a little bit more of a finished look. And then we're going to set our makeup and then I'm going to do this really pretty kind of pinky nude look for my lips today. I use the eye primer and have trouble with eyeshadow sticking to a couple spots on the eyelid. And, um, Tanya, you're going to want to let your eye primer dry a little bit longer before you go in with it. Is my recommendation. Okay, so now our eyes are done. I'm going to set my makeup and then we'll do our mascara and our lipstick. Okay, so set it all. And that is going to completely take away that makeup-y look or the powdery look on your skin. It also helps to prevent your makeup from transferring on your phone or on anyone. <laughs> um, it just keeps everything together. Is there a bundle for something just starting out with makeup? Yes, so Jade, I would highly recommend to check out the sets and collections on my website. So you'll go to rayahopebeauty.com and then you'll click on um, collections and sets. And they have probably like six or eight, I forget how many bundles, but there's a bunch of bundles on there that you can choose from. It's fully customizable and they're all listed at 15% off. So it's the perfect little like starter kit. So if you're looking to save money and get you started off on a really good foot, definitely grab either the kudos and or the collection. My recommendation as of this month has been to get the Kudos and the Eye Arsenal collection. That gives you literally a full makeup look at a heck of a discount. Beauty box, yes, so the beauty box is for presenters. So if you're wanting to join and do what I do, then you can join and get the um, presenters kit, which is now called the beauty box. So you can do that if you're willing or if you're wanting to join and be a presenter. Okay, so for my lashes, I'm using the Lash Primer, and then I'm using the 4D Mascara, and this gives you, like, the best length and volume for your eyelashes. It makes them literally touch your eyebrows. It's so, so good. So if you have really short, stubby lashes, this is the combo you're going to want. So again, it's the Lash Primer and the 4D Mascara. And I'm just popping this on the bottom of my lashes, taking it all the way up, and then coating the back. And then you could do as many coats of this as you're wanting, it's all up to you. But we're gonna apply about two coats, just like that. All right, so now for lips, I'm gonna do my lip liner in the shade Prudent, and I'm gonna fill in my whole lip with this. I love these lip liners, I'm gonna sharpen it using Unique Sharpener. It's the best sharpener ever. It's under tools, if you guys didn't know. Um, it's only $7.50, but it actually sharpens all of your pencils, your eye pencils and your lip pencils, and it doesn't jack them up. <laughs> Thank you. I know. I love this combo. The Waterproof Epic Mascara. So it's Epic Waterproof Black Mascara. Vicky, it's going to be under eyelashes. All right, so I'm going to line my lips, and then I'm going to fill them in. So start up here. And then we'll color in. Can you get the beauty box if you don't want to be a presenter? Um, I wouldn't recommend it. <clears throat> I would only usually recommend getting the presenter's kit if you're wanting to be a presenter. If you're wanting a really good deal with a ton of makeup, I would get the collections and sets. And then I would do the either the eye arsenal collection with the kudos or I would get the ready set prep collection with the kudos. Both of those are the best deals. Oh, thank you, Donna. Yes, I love this color combo. All right, so once we got prudent all on, 
Now I'm gonna go in with the lipstick in the shade Conceited. So this is gonna be like a really pretty kind of like Barbie doll pink. But because we put it over prune it, it kind of lightens it up a little bit. And now I'm gonna take my finger and blend that out. Like this. Okay. And then I'll wipe off that lipstick off my finger. And then now I'm gonna go in with the lip gloss in the shade Luxe. And yes, the blush that I have on is the shade Sisterly. And then we're gonna just dust it on top with Luxe and that's gonna make it a little more nude as well. And there we are. Just kind of a simple, peachy, everyday-ish kind of look. And that was the tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Kind of threw it together really quickly. I'm actually gonna pop back on and do my hair with you guys if you're wanting to see how I curl my hair. Um, be sure to hang out. I'll be back on in probably like four minutes to do that. But if you guys have any questions, if you need to be color matched, um, just message me here on Facebook. Just click on my face. A little description window should pop down and you can click on my name. That will take you to my Facebook page and you can send me a message there. You'll look for a little box with like a squiggly. Um, that's how to message me. And then if you guys need um, anything, just message me here on Facebook or Instagram. My Instagram name is also pinned in the description or you can search Rhea Hope there. I'm actually doing a giveaway all the month of April. Super easy to enter all you have to do is like and comment on my pictures for the month of april on instagram super simple um deanna message me here on facebook and i can help you um but yes if you have any questions on joining or on what products to get um and nancy you'll shop right here rayahopebeauty.com that's where you can find all the makeup that i just used including the brand new primer make sure that you check out the kudos it's honestly the best deal ever um and i'll see you guys in a few minutes thanks for watching bye